Okay, so this is awkward. Um, this is my cell phone. Same cell phone I've been using for the longest. Uh, my iPhone 6S Plus. It's a great phone. I tried to replace this phone once, a long time ago, and the replacement was this. Wow. The replacement was this. It was a Droid Turbo 2. This is not a bad phone. The first thing I noticed about it, and the first thing I loved about it was there's a texture on the back. Um, it'll be in the detailed photos at the very end of this here video, but the texture is this nice, soft, rubbery, leathery-like feel um, material. It just feels really good in your hand. When you hold the phone, you really and truly have some grip, no matter what you know you're holding um, a high-quality phone. It is a high quality phone. It's a great phone. The camera is amazing. It's like a 21 megapixel camera in here. I'm like, whoa, it's good. It has a slight tint of green to it. Um, unless it's on the natural sunlight, it's amazing in natural sunlight. Um, just a really good camera in here. It's phenomenally amazing. It's actually better than the one that came in this guy right here, which is my, you know, my favorite phone I use all the time. Well, I keep breaking cases. I love the feel of this guy. I keep breaking cases with this guy. And my case is always a clear case um, that has a bumper around it and a clear back. So I can either put um, coupons or, or little notes in the back and everything. And I can tra It's transparent so I can see it. Here, I'm tired. I'm tired of replacing cases. I replaced two cases. The first one lasted a couple years, which was nice. The second one only lasted a couple months. So my phone is older, so it's overheating. And because it's overheating, because it's working harder, it's abusing and making the case that the phone is in swell, um, un become unglued or whatever you want to call it. It's just not working. So I got something new. Heard about these guys. It's called eGrips. So this is kind of the unpackaging or um, unboxing. There's no box. It's just unpacking. So you get it. Just slide it out of this little thing here, and it's made in America. So um, this is what you pay $13 for. It's basically, it's grippy, just very similar to this, to this material here, but it's a little bit more stickier. There's, um, it's basically a rubbery grip with an adhesive right beneath it. So I can just slap it and put it on my phone anywhere I want. Um, I can either put it the entire thing on there or just get any of these strips. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some of these strips and put it on my phone somehow, some way. Um, I don't wanna use everything in here just yet, but I will use a couple of them to make everything look really, really nice. But again, these are the E strips. And somehow tonight I'm going to Put it on this device here. So let's get started. Oh, and here's the thing. If you know me, you know I use my cell phones to do my um, videos. So if my cell phones are here, both of them, how am I doing this? Unfortunately, I had to pull out the really old iPhone 5S, maybe. Hang on, let me get a little closer here. What's it say? Oh, man, I can't see that at all. Hang on. Uh, it just says iPhone. That's so weird. Whatever. Okay, um, I'm using my old iPhone, or the wife's old iPhone, because um, I repaired it, and after I repaired it, I was like, you know, I'm just going to use it because she got another one. You know? But I guess this would be the drink time part. So... I gotta get to work on this. Um, if you see a horse with Sam Fisher on it, then it's just an illusion, okay? I got other junk that I'm working on today. Yeah. <sighs> I hope this works out. And we're gonna do a couple of safe practices here. Um, people always say when you're doing, when you're adding on equipment, when you're doing stuff like that, 
you always want to turn off your device. So I'm turning off my device now. Um, my device is already cleaned up, but I'm just gonna wipe it down one more time because you want this to be attached to the cleanest surface that you can get your hands on. So I'm trying to make mine ultra, ultra clean. So I'm gonna wipe it around just a little bit. There we go. Ah, I don't know which ones I'm gonna use. I was thinking of using one big one, maybe. Maybe just use that long one right there. So I'm just gonna peel this off real quick. Just gonna put this going straight down there. And you just press it on wherever you want it to be. You have all of this, each one of these, so it's, it's supposed to be 13 pieces. Um, each one of these 13 pieces you can just peel and just put in the way you want. So let me see. So that one's good for the palm of my hands because it's hitting right there. So let me put a couple more on this side here. Peel this off here. You know what? I'm probably going to go for a pattern too. One second. Just going to put this. There we go. I believe I'm going to go for like a geometrical almost pattern here. There we go. You see where I'm going with this? You see where I'm going with this here? I'm gonna put the last one like way. Oh, look at you see that? It's almost forming a K. Look at that. Doesn't feel bad. In the light, it looks a little bit like a hexagon pattern. Let's see what it feels now. Oh yeah, see that that feels good because see I'm going for the three fingers, you know. I'm going for the three fingers, and that's a nice grip. I think I'm missing a little bit right here. So if I can get a small one right there, I think that'll do it. There we go. Yeah, see, that gives me a little bit of grip. I don't know how this is going to do in my pocket, but that gives me a whole lot of grip right there. Look at that. See, so I can just go to my phone, pick it up, move it around. I like that. Yeah, that's nice because it's it's pulling back. I really like that. I think the next thing I'm gonna do, I might put one more strip going across here because I have a tendency when I play video games, my pinky kind of rolls down there. But you can't on an iPhone, you can't really cover that up because your audio is down here too, and your um, lightning cable is uh, port is down here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a strip right across here to try to enhance that just a little bit. And that's what it looks like on the other side. It's just a plain old adhesive. Now hopefully this will not interfere with my um, cell phone signal or anything. You ain't gotta put this stuff on straight, it don't matter. Oh, but man, you can really feel your freaking phone. It's, it's grippy. And that's what counts. You want your phone to be grippy a little bit because this is this is good. It lets me know that the phone is there. I can hold on to it and everything, but see, it's still going to slide. This guy here, no, it's not going to slide. And I'm, I'm not BSing you on this here. It really is. There you go. I think it might have had this for a while. I'm not moving my fingers whatsoever. And eventually it's just gonna bingo. But here, you put that there, you put it here, it's just hanging there. Extremes. Ex that's that's extreme. That's extreme there. Okay, see, holding my hold my thumb back. Yeah, that's nice. There. Don't break your case. There you go. Don't break the face of it. Woo! I'll be real pissed off if I broke the face of my freaking phone right now. <sighs> I'm rambling a little bit. That's okay. 
got um purple drink with me today and I think that concludes this video here I'm gonna take some photos of this this is some um, not so bad stuff here you guys have fun and um, if you ever wanted to do this here um, it was only 13 bucks whether you buy it from them or if you buy it from Amazon it's only gonna be 13 bucks and it's 12 pieces not um, 13 pieces so it's 12 pieces for 13 bucks, 13.99, 95 or whatever. I'll put the I'll put it in the description below. But um this is it. This is just some nice grippy material to give your phone a back, a sticky back so you can, you know, have it in your hand and not fall out. It is designed to fall out of your hand. It's so slick, it's so slender. Yeah, this really helps out a lot. So I'm going to go ahead and put my password in here. I can't show you what my password is. It's 114. Nope. 